so uh, uh, sorry I'm trying to do something with the it automatically zooms in my camera it's my phone but uh, I picked up I'll just move this out of the way these two items very budget friendly kind of virtual reality headset and uh, it comes with a free case um, so this is uh, kind of an impulse buy I saw it at Toys R Us uh, I tend to pop in there sometimes to look at some of their retro clones, which I've seen a million times and have no intention of buying, but I was trying to kill time, so there you go. Um, so this is a smart theater. Uh, a lot of, it's uh, kind of a Chinese, it says might made in China on it. Uh, virtual reality headset, it's 20 bucks, uh, which is less than the, um, what the hell is that one that they have in Toys R Us and Target. Um, Viewmaster, the Viewmaster one, uh, which actually this one has a strap, and uh, I'm not sure about. Let's see, hundreds of free apps to download and talk about the Play Store. Uh, fits any size smartphone. Uh, I have probably a medium size kind of smartphone. I don't know what to say about it. Ultra light headset. It only has one strap. It's not too uh, head, you know, over the top and round, whatever. Anti-microbial anti face rest uh, and a four-way independently adjustable lens. An input trigger. Oh, it has an input trigger. I didn't even see that. It has an input trigger. That's a good thing. Uh, the one I have is, um, the hell is it? The Homeido headset. Um, so that one was fairly expensive. It was probably $70 when I got it or something like that. And it comes with a case too. This one seems, um, you know, we'll see. Let's unbox it. Uh, but first, uh, here's the free thing. This is already open, so it's easier to uh, show the case. So, yeah, it's kind of a, yeah, that kind of stuff. What do you call that? Uh, carbon type, whatever. And it comes with cloth, obviously. It just fell out, and I didn't even know it was there. So, let's clean the lenses. And has this. And yeah, it's just a little case. Just put it in. Similar to the one I have for the home needle, but the home needle one is bigger. So I'm assuming this uh, is not as big as the home needle headset. So we'll see. See what you get. And maybe I can compare it and see see if uh, how it compares to the home needle. Okay, so we have a box with a box inside of it. And oh, this thing also comes with, because I just saw it. This is really cool. This thing comes with what's called a real control. A real control is kind of a way to get your hands in VR on you know, Google Play uh, apps. So supported apps, there's only a couple I know of, but it's cool. Supported apps, you can actually have your hand show up kind of in, uh, in your VR apps on your phone. So that's something even the Oculus doesn't come with. Um, apparently not, people aren't digging that, that machine too much right now, or at least the... Uh, the, the, uh, yeah, the company, whatever. Okay, so we, here we have. Well, let, let's pull out the real control and show you what that is. is it, well, here's uh, here's some documentation. Everybody loves to see the documentation. Um, let's see. So the real control basically consists of these two things here, and they're basically the camera picks up the real control. And I'm not exactly sure how this is put together. We'll figure it out. I believe this actually has a trigger. I'm not sure. The newer one has a trigger. But uh, you just see it has a QR code and all these other things. And it basically, the camera picks it up and is able to give you inputs from your hands and stuff like that. So that's really cool. It's just a piece of cardboard. You could print one out yourself and put it together, but it comes with one already done. Now here's the headset fairly small headset. Um, see, it's in a, it comes in plastic. I'll unwrap it. It's very light. Here's the thing here. There's the, the lenses. Uh, lenses are probably not as big as the Homidos, so yeah. That's Plastic feels a little cheap. It is a cheap device, so what do you expect? Uh, it's not a $70 uh, product. It also comes on the bottom, there's a QR code, so you scan it, 
into your phone, it will uh, have the, you know, the thing. <laughs> You'll basically be able to have it set up for your, your uh, headset. And then, uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, these, ha these are like this. We have these. I'm not always a big fan of uh, that kind of thing. Uh, having it like that because when you have this opening here it tends to uh, create some annoying uh, looking stuff I don't know <laughs> um, and then it has the trigger this is like one of those touch things I think yeah so it touches the screen so you get an input on the screen so if it asks you to touch the screen you can use that that's something the home you know doesn't have um, but yeah like I said the, the lenses are not as big I don't know how this is going to be on the face. It's very kind of just like a regular foamy. It almost feels like a rubbery foam. Hmm. So, yeah. And it looks like it, it should be comfortable. I don't know. We'll see. Um, it's very light. Uh, so that's a good thing. That's the plus. Uh, looking into it, I don't see the sides of the, uh, of the headset. Uh, with the one of the headsets I have, you can see the sides and the the screen will reflect off the sides and things like that. So I don't see that as being a problem right now. Um, and put the straps together. So this only has the one that goes around the back of your head. Um, I may be too retarded to put this together. So how does this work? This has. It just goes through like this, and then through the other one, I think. Okay, we're, we're trying. I think it just loops through like that. Then you put it over your head, um, and, and now if I can... Yeah. Now I look like an asshole. Hello. <laughs> um, so yeah, you look like a moron. Yay. All right. Making sweating and I'm covered in fucking rain. Yay. Um, so that's that part. Now what else am I missing here? Um, am I missing something? And then there's this. I think I didn't mention this. This strap just basically goes over your phone. Let me grab my. Oh, I'm gonna grab my phone. Yeah, right. I'm recording with it. Um, yeah, it straps over your phone. You basically put your phone there, strap it up like this. It stretches, so it should fit your phone. I don't know about the Note series or anything like that. Um, I don't have one, so you know, that's that. <laughs> um, that's that. Yeah. So, I'm trying to think, what else? They also have it in white, and that's that. So, I guess I'm going to put together the real control. Really looking forward to this. Never been so excited over a piece of cardboard in my life. <laughs> um, yeah, there you go. That's it. Thank you for watching.